Welcome to Devices Setup and today we will learn the difference between extender mode or access point mode that we get in our Wi-Fi extender or Wi-Fi repeater during the setup process. So let's see which one you should choose to fix your Wi-Fi. I'll explain the technical difference, the pros and cons of each and which option works best for different homes. Let's go. So let's simply learn what each mode actually is. So extender or repeater mode connects wirelessly to your router, then rebroadcast that wireless signal to extend coverage. No ethernet cable is needed in this setup and it is called wireless repeater mode or range extender mode. Next comes the access point mode. In this, the extender or repeater is connected to the router by ethernet cable and it creates a new Wi-Fi access point using that wired backhaul. So let's quickly check some of their key technical differences. So the extender creates a wireless backhaul because it is connected to the router wirelessly whereas the access point mode is connected to the router in wired backhaul. Second, a basic wireless repeater often cuts effective throughput because it must use the same radio to receive and resend the traffic, it can lose up to 50% in worst cases on single band devices. Whereas the access point mode keeps full speed because the backhaul is wired. On the top of that, high end extenders with dedicated backhaul like dual band or tri band works even faster. Third, the access point mode gives you lower latency and more stable internet, whereas the extender mode provides higher latency and slower internet spatially through walls. Fourth, depending upon the primary routers and extenders compatibility, the seamless roaming can be available in both the modes. So now let's check the pros and cons of the extender or repeater mode first. So some of the pros are, it is super easy to set up, no cables needed, cheap and convenient for small dead zones and useful if you can't run wiring. Now some of the cons are, it can significantly reduce the Wi-Fi speed and increase latency, especially the single band devices. The performance drops with distance and walls and it is not ideal for high bandwidth tasks like 4K streaming or gaming. Now let's check the pros and cons of access point mode. It provides best performance and lower latency because of wired backhaul also provides full bandwidth for clients ideal for streaming gaming and home offices provides stable coverage with predictable speed now let's check some of the cons of access point mode so it requires ethernet cable which means more work and more cost also slightly more setup is required like running cable throughout your house than just plugging the extender in a repeater mode so which mode you should use so if you own a small apartment, then a wireless extender or wireless repeater mode is usually fine, quick, cheap and effective for minor dead zones. Whereas if you have a typical suburban home with one or two floors and moderate drywalls, then access point mode will be better for stable whole home coverage. And if wiring isn't possible, consider a high quality dual band extender with a dedicated backhaul or a mesh system. You can check video on our channel to learn which mesh system is best for you. Also, on the channel you will find important video which explains the best location to plug the Wi-Fi extender. Moreover, if you own a large multi-story home, then the best option will be to get a mesh Wi-Fi system. So talking about the final verdict which is better overall, so the access point mode or wired is best overall when you care about speed, stability and low latency. If your house allows you to run an ethernet cable throughout, then pick access point mode. The extender or repeater mode wins for ease and no wiring convenience, but expect some performance compromise. If you must use a wireless extender mode, then invest in one with a dedicated backhaul band or consider switching to a mesh for better roaming. Do let me know in the comment section which mode you are going to use. Is it going to be the repeater mode or the access point mode? 
or maybe you would like to go with the mesh Wi-Fi system. Also, please don't forget to like and subscribe for more home Wi-Fi tips. Thank you so much and I hope you have a blessed day.